Across the United States, the families of 81 organ, eye, and tissue donors will complete memorable fluorograph portraits of their loved ones that will light up the world as beacons of hope in the 2014 Rose Bowl Parade. Each honored individual is remembered by their generosity, compassion, and lives saved and healed through donations after death. Please join TGMC as we speak about the Louisiana Organ Procurement Agency, the importance of organ and tissue donation, and a very special donor from HOMA, Robin Dwaron. All right, Lynn and Robin, welcome aboard. How are y'all today? Good, thank Good. you for having us. All right, our first question is going to go to Atlanta tonight. We appreciate y'all being here. What is LOPA? Explain that to us, please. Well, LOPA is the Louisiana Organ Procurement Agency, and we're the uh, state's organ and tissue recovery agency. We do organ and tissue recovery from deceased patients. Uh, we also house the Louisiana Donor Registry. So if you're registered to become an organ donor through your driver's license, you've registered through LOPA. All right. Tell us about the Donate Life Rose Parade float that's going to be in the upcoming Rose Bowl Parade and the florograph what is that well we're really excited because this year well every year we get involved with the national donate life rose parade float and that takes place in california on new year's day so that's a really big parade that i know a lot of us watch um it'll be on on i'm sorry january 1st 2014 and it is going to be a float honoring organ tissue and eye donors uh, it's actually over 40 million people view this float. Also about 81 fluorographs will be on the float and that'll be, the fluorographs will be made of different um, organic materials and flowers to look like other, from photographs of donors, so. All right, now there's a very special honoree from Homa, Louisiana that is gonna be represented on the float. Give us a little details on that. I know y'all are very excited about it. We're very that. excited. Yeah. I'll let Rachel. Rachel, go ahead. That one's yours. <laughs> yes. Um, this year, um, my sister Robin is going to be the um, honoree. Um, she she passed away um, October 2004, and um, she was an um, she was an organ and tissue donor. And um, when she passed away, um, my family and I um, decided to um, donate her organs and um she she was an organ donor that is fantastic yes, and, and yes. thanks so much for that mm -hmm. we're really excited to have uh robin's mm -hmm. fluorograph from from coming from homa this year so mm -hmm. with 81 across the whole country mm -hmm. uh on the float it's mm -hmm. really a big huge honor to have that yes. a big float yes. too. big float yeah yes. yes bigger than any we've seen around here yes is there a special event for robin here in homa a uh, prior to the uh, Rose Parade? Yes, LOPA and Terrebonne General Medical Center will be partnering to hold a fluorograph event on uh, Tuesday, December the 3rd at 4 p.m. in the lobby of the hospital, and we welcome all to attend. Um, what we're gonna do is the fluorograph will be close to completion, and we'll have Rachel and her family complete the remainder of the fluorograph, and it'll be the first time that the family sees the fluorograph, as well of, as all of us and all of the community. So we definitely encourage anybody that can to come out. It's a, it's a really nice mm -hmm. event that we're looking forward to. Some so. really neat stuff. We're yeah. gonna take a break. We're coming right back to talk more. Don't go away, it's all next as we continue. 